Rose is back from the hand. Okay. What's up? <laughs> oh, sad reality. Yeah, Going back to silverware. Back to where? How are you? Good. Nice. How are you? Good. How was your trip? Amazing. Spent a little bit too much money. I spent four hundred dollars just on dessert one night when I got super drunk. So I'm in debt to Corey. What's been going on with you? Uh, not What's much. New? Just working and. Uh, Saturday night. I miss you, by the way. I know. I had just literally flew back yeah, from the Hamptons. Course. Like, I love Tom, but how'd it go? What happened? Um, it was great. It looks great from yeah, the stories. He killed it. At the end of the night, James got in a fight with Allie, and they were arguing loud enough for security to come over, escorting James out wow, of what? the club. What? Allie, why are you rolling your eyes? She was like, he was telling me he only has eyes for me, and I'm not with his eyes, and all of these things. Oh, and really? I'm going to go tell him to shut the f up. He was ready to go, and he was telling Ali, OK, it's time to go. And maybe she wasn't ready to leave yet. I'm sure it had something to do with the conversation that I had with Ali. Well, what was the conversation you had with Ali? Asking her when James told her that he had sex with Lala, because now the cat's out of the bag. Well, and what, he what, told me. Ali needs to know that information. I don't think that's your place to you to tell her that. But you're putting her in a position that you know what oh, it felt no, no, like no. too. No, no, that is not my fault. Anything, no, I any know. argument that they have is not my fault. I know. You can give someone so many warnings, but at the end of the day, people have to do what they need to do and figure it out themselves. Yeah, I know. I want to know, how have you been? Honestly, I've been hearing a few things. I bet. James got escorted out by security that night. He was fighting with Ali loud enough for security to get involved. So you know what I'm talking about? You... Um, yeah, you know, it's definitely been interesting bringing the alcohol back into my life. Why did you make that decision? I don't you know, were doing Lisa, so because well. Because Raquel and I broke up, I had to, I don't know, like, figure it out for myself. I just wanted to get out there again, right? I hadn't been on a date or anything yet. I was excited to go out for, like, an Italian dinner on the veranda with a b bottle of... Cabernet with a sexy brunette. You know what I mean? And I went and did that. I went and did that. And here is the Igor's breakfast. Thank you. I just feel like I'm an older, more mature guy. I know you were devastated over Raquel, but what's going on now, James? With Ali? What? I'm, I'm, I'm in love with Ali. Like... But you were telling me when you were with Raquel that she was the best thing that ever happened to you. And now it is And now it. you're saying the same thing again. Well, I've always been an emotional guy. I've always definitely, you know... I know that. I've fallen in love anybody. quickly. You were heartbroken and you were devastated. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, guys. And I'm sorry to Raquel, I'm too. Sorry she has been to my you, best right. friend for f***ing five years. She's gotten me through literally so much. Just thinking about it makes me feel like I'm on a faint. You know? It's okay. It's a lot. It's a lot, but you, you know, it's in the past as well. Do you think you're ready for another well. relationship? Yes, yeah. You do? 